throws, crucial turnovers. They got within four with 3.03 to go. On their feet in Memphis. Conley in the lane. Tough release. Got it! Three to go. Mike Conley typically loves to finish with his right hand, wow. but that time of the down. Beautiful jump stop around Iguodala. Avoids the block. Beautiful play there. What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Juice McGee III, and I'm in here to give y'all what I think will be one of the best pick-and-roll point guard builds in the game. And I modeled it after the boy, Mike Conley, which means not only will you be able to abuse the pick-and-roll, but you can shoot if you need to, and you can get to the hole if you need to, and then when you ain't got the ball in your hands, I promise you, you can defend. And if you need a big man build to run that pick and roll with, check the link in the description because I got one for you. Now, let's get into this build. All right, so what you want to do first off is obviously pick the playmaker pie chart because, you know, you want as many playmaking badges as possible, and I'm going to get you as many as you need to run this build effectively. And for the physical pie chart, just go with the one that's even on all ends because you get a nice balanced speed, vertical, but you also get strength, which you're going to need on the defensive end, I promise you. All right, now pause the video if you need to, but what you can see is close shot and driving layup were maxed out. The mid-range, your three-point, your free throw are maxed out. All of your playmaking, max it all out. And then spend the rest of those points in defense, more on the perimeter-oriented defensive categories all right so for official height mike conley is 6'1 i know he's short but look what that acceleration is now we ain't even done because this official weight is 175 and now look at that acceleration you're gonna be blowing by him that's just it's gonna be easy uh his official wingspan was measured at 79 inches but we can't do 79 so we're gonna go 79.2 all right, and you can see the options for takeover. You got playmaker, slasher, and shot creator. You do what you want to, but pick playmaker if you want to make this pick and roll beast I'm, I'm trying to help you build. We have built the slash and playmaker, and you see that name on the bottom, Mike Conley. This build is a lot better defensively than Steve Nash or Steph Curry, but, you know, that's what 2K, that's what 2K thinks. I don't agree with it. Let's get into these badges. All right, so you can see here that we ended up with 50 four badges six of those are hall of fame badges nine of those are gold badges and then we got one silver one bronze but i'm gonna show you what you need first up finishing now finishing is the least important badge category here so you can pretty much put this on wherever you feel most comfortable i decided to go acrobat because he is six one but you do what you do all right so shooting here's the thing Silver quick draw is enough for me, but I know that some of you might want a faster release than that. So what I would suggest is taking gold off of hot zone hunter or difficult shots and making your quick draw gold. Don't take it off dead eye because the pick and roll with the pick and roll, you need gold dead eye. I promise you. But I went gold difficult shots, gold dead eye, gold hot zone hunter. Do what you want to. All right, here's the fun one. Playmaking. So, first, you want to go gold floor general, gold dimer. You're a point guard. You need that. You, you boost your teammates' shooting attributes, and you boost their overall attributes. And then, Hall of Fame, ankle breaker, stop and go, tight handles, unpluggable, quick first step, space creator. Man, they will not be able to stay in front of you. Man, when y'all see this gameplay, I just wish I was a better dribbler than I am. Because with y'all go see in this gameplay how easy it is to get past them. And imagine if I was a better dribbler than what I am. But let's, let's get to defense, man. I'm making myself mad. All right. So, you're a point guard. You play on a perimeter. So, for gold, for these badges, just, just get gold clamps. Lightning reflexes because the little thing shows up and shows you which way they're going. Pickpocket so you can, you know, steal the ball. And then Intimidator. You know, you lower the attributes a little. I think that's what it does. 
I, I can't be 100% sure on what it does, but I know it helps when you're in front of someone with the ball. And that's what I think you should do for the these defensive badges. And there you go. I gave you the attributes and the badges needed to create this pick and roll beast. So now I'm going to throw in some gameplay footage so I can show you exactly how this build does what it does. And I put myself on the Bulls because I was like, oh, let, me, let me pick a team that does not have a great point guard. So let's get into this. Let me show you how to do this. All right, first play. I'm going to call for this ISO real quick so I can see if I can break him down myself. Dribble right. Dribble right, step back, and look at that. He already on the flow. That's too easy. Next play, I'm just on a fast break. Look at that. Look how fast he is. I literally ran by everybody. All right, next play, I'm going to call for this pick and roll because it's after easy to get by him, and I draw the defense in. Look at that. Easy dunk, which is why you need a good big man. Look at that. He was so wide open. All right, I'm bringing this ball up. I'm going to go behind the back, froze him, dot. Lori Marketing, easy money. All right, bring the ball up. Call for the pick, and look at that. I'm at the hole already. Too easy. All right, I'm coming up. Snatch him. You know it don't count if you don't make the shot. Green, beam. All right, I'm coming down. I'm going to call this pick and roll again. Watch this. Uh, and uh, oop. I am having a really hard time trying to understand how he just missed this easy. Ooh, this is why the Bulls will never be as good as they were in the 90s. I mean, come on, man. If your big man cannot catch and put down an easy oop like that, then you might as well pack your bags. I mean, seriously, I think this year Phoenix might actually. Sorry, y'all. I had a moment. Anyway, let's look at this next play. Watch me lock him up. Nah, nope, gold clamps. No, 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 nah, bro. No, bro, I got gold clamps. I got gold clamps. That's what he telling him right now. Like, bro, I got gold clamps. You can't do this. Anyway, last play, just another pick and roll. Come down, throw him the oop, and he, he actually catches it this time. All right, and there you go. 26 points, 15 assists, a block and a steal. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to give this a thumbs up. Please comment and do not forget to like and subscribe. This is your boy Juice McGee Third, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.